Welcome to a cup of coffee and free paintings. I'm gonna be in Oslo this uh, Friday, the 21st of uh, July, and I'm gonna do a live stream at 1300 on my Instagram at Martinsoni, and I'm gonna hide these paintings, and you can get them for free. But free paintings is just the title to lure you in, because if you want to, you can vips me whatever the amount you want to vips me. Uh, when you find these paintings. So on my Instagram live stream, Friday, 21st of July at 1300, I will post the video afterwards in case you can't be there for the live stream. Uh, I do a live stream every Friday, so but this uh, Friday, the 21st of July at 1300 at Matemansoni on Instagram, I'm gonna be uh, doing a live stream where I show you where I hide these paintings that I'm gonna make now. There are 10 times 10 centimeters and, it's, and they're a little fat on the side as well, which is cool. And I'm gonna do these very easy paintings and that's what we're gonna do in today's YouTube video. New YouTube video every Friday on this channel at Martin on, on YouTube. And uh, I thought, uh, why not do a little punk rock thing and uh, make these small paintings and put them around different spots in Oslo and if you find these paintings please uh, post it on your Instagram and tag me and uh, if you uh, uh, post them on your Instagram yeah just tag me and share them in your story it would be really cool and I thought it would be interesting to see uh, if the ones that find these paintings uh, I want to see them in your home wherever you live if you live on the street and let me see how it is if you want to give them as a present whatever just want to see where these paintings, uh, the journey of these paintings uh, go. And as I said, I have, I'm have i going to write my phone number on the side. And if you are uh, don't have VIPs, you can use PayPal. But uh, I would rather you just uh, easily just VIPs whatever amount you want to. And if it's uh, 10,000, who knows? Maybe some rich dude's going to find this or a woman. And um, if you want to VIPs, from 10,000, 50,000, let's say 100,000, from 100,000 to fucking 10 kroners, whatever you want to vips, uh, you can vips it. And I, I will admit that I hesitated on calling this video even free paintings because I don't want to give the impression that I do free paintings or free art. I share my art for free, but I do art full time. So uh, I'm not going to lie, uh, getting a like on a painting or thumbs up it's not gonna pay my bills uh, it's uh, shit to say this out loud but that's the fucking truth and uh any money whatever comes in helps me to continue living full-time being an artist so whatever contribution you do uh is very helpful and even if you're watching this right now and you want the vips to 928-92699 and just uh, uh mark the payment art i love your art or whatever because everything helps every fucking artist is a whore and a hobo so <laughs> that's that's how it is this is the life i chose anyway let's get started i've actually prepared myself this time with uh um with paint so we're just gonna get started right away on these uh selected uh paintings we're gonna oh shit that was the wrong color. we're gonna bless them with uh, coffee Oh shit, this is why I don't have paintings by here, because I spilled coffee now. We're gonna bless all of these with some coffee on it, just to get started. Uh, maybe even dribble a little bit like this. There you go. So, um, let's paint, let's paint. Mm. Okay, uh, I have no pre-plan of what I'm going to paint, so let's just uh, get started by doing some, getting some color on there. Let's do some abstract stuff. So I'm starting with my, my favorite kind of colors these days, which are these little blob figurines. So we made just a blob now like this. And then let's add some color to it, like this, some green. 
what's shit about green now i haven't tested all of the different um uh paint brands but uh i find that most of these insane neon colors especially acrylic are really shit because they're like more sh uh, like see-through shiny let's see if this is like painting you're gonna watch not just me so i'm just gonna have some fun with these at first see the paintings now mm -hmm. yeah, as good as it can get maybe a little bit higher up this uh, this this is the life of the artist you see right here is you are joining me as i'm winging this so let's this one on the corner is just going to be more like abstract have all the colors on there and sounds maybe a little bit stupid but doing uh, this when i'm just gonna be putting them out and not even getting paid to do this it gives me a sort of a freedom as well because then i'm not thinking even though you should never be thinking like that but i don't think i have to make it like this and this uh, in order to get some money for this so it gives me some freedom to do this and it's also fun and I like the interactive part and I also love the working outside of uh, a studio like a gallery just doing my own thing doing it a little bit like punk rock and I'm bringing these on plane uh, so can't be too uh, thick the lines I already like them like they are now though so and now I'm gonna try and make a little bit like on this one i really like this one so i'm gonna make a face hair i'm gonna use uh, first just white like this and then... so if you want to be the owner of this these paintings then you have to uh, uh, join the live stream on my instagram which is if you're watching this on the release day uh, of the this YouTube video it is uh, Friday the 21st of July and if you're watching it then uh, you have a chance to uh, to get it before it gets taken by somebody else because this video is uploaded at six minutes past six on a on Friday and the live stream is uh, uh, the live stream is at 1300 so maybe you are the lucky guy who gets this or woman or girl or trans or whatever uh, and then we're going to use yellow around this section try and mix it up a little bit i don't always go for the same fucking colors i have a tendency to i'm trying to be better at using a lot of different sets of colors there we go and now we're gonna have blue eyes. Put in the middle there. So I think I'm gonna go with all these faces actually. I kinda like that. And then just gonna have I'm gonna give him a mohawk. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna give him a mohawk. A green one. And it's really, really, really enjoyable to make this. Um, then we're gonna have black in the center of the eye here to make it more detail-y than the other ones that I've made previous. And then, and the good thing about it, it's acrylic on canvas, so it will be dry before I travel, because I want to do maybe something similar and do it with actual uh, oil painting, just to really, uh, because it's cool to do this in different cities. But I will uh, most likely do it in small formats like this. Because it have art supplies cost, man. Okay, and then we're going to do the next face. Uh, uh. I'm going to give him 
purple eyes. Yes. And I'm not gonna lie, recently I've been really not inspired and feeling really lazy and just wanna actually, I've been sleeping a lot, slacking. After Tons of Rock, I kinda had like a really almost depression because I don't know, I was just really looking forward to that uh, festival and I had a very good uh, sale of my art at Tons of Rock and it helped me pay a lot of debt that I had and I, I, it's amazing and I, I love it but I kind of thrive on uh, having no money makes me work harder so it's uh, been a little bit difficult for me to get back on the horse if you can if you know what I mean I've just been stressed as well like I don't know not depressed uh, uh, but just a little bit unmotivated everybody goes through that like sometimes you're just not motivated and I need something to work towards. I have something planned in the end of the year. Uh, but it's not a solo exhibition. So I really want to have a solo exhibition in Oslo. So I, that's why I came up with this idea. To do it like uh, in, a, in a really colorful, fun way. Like if, uh, if I don't have a solo exhibition in Oslo at some gallery. Uh, then I'll just make my own gallery in the streets. I'm going to be skating a lot, uh, hopefully. It's, uh, the weather is supposed to be shit now, so it's, I'm a little bit worried about that. But I'm uh, going to go watch art and then skate the indoor parks if it's really crap weather. Okay, I'm going to give him some eyelashes, actually. This guy. And he's going to have more center around his eyes. I'm really excited to see if people actually find these uh, and uh, if they are gonna be posting them because what really helps me as an artist is if you share my artwork on social media and if you uh, uh, if you post my art so even if you find this, these free paintings that I'm going to be putting out in the streets of Oslo and you don't want to pay and you don't, you can't pay, you just don't have any money, you don't want to pay. Uh, it's a, it's fair. Like, I'm not going to say that you have to, but just posting or sharing, even if you don't have these, just sharing uh, a post of my art on your Instagram takes you fucking a couple of seconds to do that not even that just doing that you are already helping me getting closer to my dream of becoming a known artist and it sounds maybe a little bit selfish but and it is but i don't care though it's the truth i want to be a known artist why because then i can do more cool exhibitions i want the galleries to notice me and uh, i want to have big exhibitions and do cool projects and travel the world and and that's main of one of the main reasons why i'm a little bit suicidal and depressed because not only because of other factors which i'm going to be sharing in the future in my art once my shrink has gone through my head a little bit more going starting again in uh, in uh, in september my birthday month and we're gonna do some, uh, I don't know what, cartlegging. I don't fucking know the English word. They're gonna find out more about the condition that I might have. Uh, they're pretty sure that I have it, but they wanna do more tests. And to be honest, I'm quite stoked on it because it makes me, it makes it easier for me to understand myself and why I am as I am <laughs> fucked up. Uh, and I like it though. It's uh, all my favorite artists are fucked up in some way or another. 
so i don't mind being fucked up i just want to know what it is so i can understand it and so i don't kill myself because i want to live but i do have those days where i'm just really uh tired and want to end my life wow this became a lot more darker uh, episode than planned uh, i'm gonna force myself to try and stop now even though i have a lot of excessive paint left and i hate not using all the paint maybe i can add it to this already the painting that i have here i don't know if it's oil or if it's acrylic so i can't use too much um we can go through these um, paintings that i already have now i'm i'm supposed to be looking here <laughs> but uh, i have the camera the other way that i'm used to so this is the first one that i i had already pre-made and uh, it's signed on the side, uh, and then my number is there. So I'm gonna, uh, this is one uh, of the paintings, and then you add this one. <laughs> I really like doing these faces though, They're really fun. So, uh, some coffee on the side there. So this is uh, painting number one of three, and that we made today in this video. And as you can see, there are some texture to it. So I don't know if this is going to be uh, like it is when I... It has to dry first before I can pack it though. And then we have this guy. <laughs> Love these. Super fun to make. So I'm just trying to have fun play with colors. And when you see these in the streets, like on the distant, I hope that they will be very visible and easy to find. Even cooler if somebody finds them. And they don't know that I've put them out there for free. So I might write it on the side or on the back or something. Free art or bips me, whatever you want. I'm going to try and write it maybe on the inside here. Yeah, I'm going to try that. And there's the last of the three we made on this video today. So I have to end this video now because it's uh, fucking almost 20 minutes long. It's going to be a nightmare to upload. So there you go. That's the three paintings that I'm gonna hide in the streets and I might even add this one might even hide this on the way in on my way to Oslo I don't know I haven't decided yet but just uh, join me on Instagram on uh, if you're watching this on the release day Friday 21st of July join me on Instagram at 1300 at Mark Menzuni and uh, see where I'm gonna hide these paintings for free and if you find them uh, this is uh, up to you though if you want to do just vips me whatever you want to my private number here and uh, everything helps I can buy a coffee maybe I can buy even a dinner uh, everything uh, helps so I call this free paintings or free art but it's uh, up to you if you want to contribute with anything but I don't expect anyone to do it just so that is crystal fucking clear New video every Friday here on my YouTube channel and uh, follow me on TikTok, on uh, Twitter, on Instagram, uh, Snapchat, Facebook page, etc. All of them at Martin Menzoni. And um, yeah, uh, uh, Snapchat is MMX85, where I sometimes put out a little teaser of things that are coming up or if I'm doing a live stream. Blah, 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 blah. I'm going to shut the fuck up. Have a nice weekend, and I, if you see me in Oslo, um, and or if you are in Oslo and want to see more of my art, visit uh, the Strawberry uh, Hotels. Uh, Comfort Hotel Grand Central has a painting uh, right next to my one of my favorites, Bjarne Melgor. You can see that. Uh, I also have it posted on my Instagram, of course, and you can see uh, most of my paintings exhibited in the lobby at Express Jungstorge, right next to Revolver and one of my favorite shops, Du. Um, and also, uh, Tors, no, not Torso, but uh, uh, that's where I get my art supplies in Oslo. But at the Tronsmo Bookhandel bookshop, you can see uh, some of my paintings and prints and stuff there as well. Okay, thanks for watching and goodbye.